بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم اسلام علیکم ڈیئر سٹوڈنٹس ایز یو نو وی ہیڈ کمپلیٹڈ سائنس سلیبس ان لاسٹ ویک نو ان دس ویک آئی ول ایکسپلین یو سم ڈائیگرامس فرام چیپٹر ون ٹو اینڈ تھری اینڈ ول اسٹارٹ ریویئن آف دس سبجیکٹ نو اوپن پیج سکس چیپٹر ون سیلولر آرگنائزیشن آف پلانٹس اینڈ اینیملس ہیئر از اے ڈائیگرام آف این اینیمل سیل اینڈ این پلانٹ سیل now i'll explain you you can see here, here is a cell wall cell wall of an uh, of a plant cell cell wall is absent in animal cell so you can see that uh, cell wall is not present in animal cell okay here is a, a, chlo a chloroplast and mitochondria mitochondria uh, is uh, uh, present in both plants and animal cells here is a cell membrane cell membrane is also present in both animal and plant cells vacuoles vacuoles are also present in plants in both plants and animal cells but uh, size of vacuole is uh, different in uh, both animal and plant cells you can see that in uh, plant cells uh, vacuole is very small and in animal cell vacuole takes a large uh, volume its size is big here is a endoplasmic endoplasmic reticulum endoplasmic reticulum is also present in both and in animal and plant cells now here is a nucleus nucleus is also present in both animal and plant cells okay centrioles centrioles is present only in animal only in animal cell and these are not present in plant cells page 9 figure 1.6 some plant tissues here you can see some plant tissues outer layer is of epidermal tissue then in center xylem and phloem tissues are present xylem as you know xylem carries water and phloem carries food in different parts of plants